Ryan, good morning. You know you can trust a good barber when they have a mustache like court. It is called the Pigpen oh, Barbershop. Wow. They just That's opened amazing. on March 2nd, right? And that does take a lot of work to be able to maintain that. So he is cutting Michael's hair right now. And actually, Michael, you may um, remember because his daughter was on for Kaylani's Corner where, or Kaylani's Cuddles, where she donated all that stuff for oh, Valentine's yeah. Day for the kids. Um, in the hospital, yes, so sweet. And so, Court, you just recently opened up. What makes you different? I, I like to really pride myself on more of keeping the traditional aspect to barbering, where it's it is old school, um, and that's where that we stem a lot of our yeah. tradition and heritage from. Um, especially with our product company that I always use as my best, that I also educate for, is Ruzel, and uh, they just teach it to be very old school with having its own way of. Tins, the old smells, the, the ability to do freehand haircuts where you don't use any guards for clippers and you're just using a comb and a clipper. Now, Michael has places to go, so I'm going to let you keep doing the haircut here. A lot of times when people go in for a haircut, they'll come in and say, hey, I want like a two on the bottom or a one on the top, but you don't do that. No, I don't. I actually had encouraged my clients to use photos or uh, use uh, haircut posters because the, the basicness to it is that Everybody's, every men's haircut's the exact same. It just ranges in length on the side and how high or low the fade is. It's the same haircut. It's just longer. So the Russell way of haircutting that we describe is that there's four haircuts, and the basic haircut you're going to always do is a flat top. Oh, okay. And uh, I remember my brother getting that when he was younger, the flat top. You were in the Marine Corps for eight years. Thank you for your service. Thanks. And we love talking about veteran-owned businesses. And so uh, you just recently opened, but people can uh, make an appointment with you. Do you do walk-ins or it's mainly appointment only? I am appointment-based uh, for the fact that I'm here in the W Salon Suites. Um, but I prefer appointments more than uh, a walk-in for the aspect that when they come in, this is my VIP for the day or for the hour that they're in here. Where they're walking, you have to kind of brush them in and out as fast as you can go um, to where I usually do my haircuts in an hour. I could get them done way beforehand, but I clean up. They come in. This room is like the, like the first person of the day. Now, be, uh, last question. What are you putting in your hair for those curls? Yeah. Yeah. I use grease. Uh, okay. The old school days of Trace Flurries and Murray's, uh, we actually have grease as well. And, oh, so uh, it is a Ruzo product that you're. Yes, I mean, is. I think the ladies could use that one too. Aren't those curls great? Yeah. Yeah. Out here in Roseville, off, off of Douglas stuff. Boulevard, the Pigpen Barber Shop. You can find them on Facebook if you want more info. Very cool, very cool.